I'm actually posting on Monday. <sighs> Hey guys, uh, welcome to Monday. Now, since I didn't get to post last week because Verizon was being a bitch and uh, it really wasn't their fault, we just had a faulty box and yeah, anyway, I didn't have internet for like six days, that was a whole lot of fun, felt very disconnected from the world, um, but it's back and I just wanted to address the topic of last week really quick because I didn't get to post. Um, so the month of November is Movember. So it's all about creating awareness for um, cancers that affect specifically men. And um, I really am down with this movement, not just because I have a crucial mustache, but because I don't think that men's issues in our society get addressed enough because I think that for men to admit that they have an issue makes them less masculine um, or at least they think it will or they will be perceived that way but either way I really like that Movember is going on um, so everybody starts out November with a clean shaven face and then they grow out their mustache in an effort to raise awareness and um, I'll leave a link in the description box below so that you can go to movember.com and donate if you really want to. Um, I already have and it's a lot of fun. I also have a very special guest I would like to introduce you guys to. Tito! Tito, come here! Tito! Come here, tits! Where'd you go, buddy? <gasps> come here! Come here, my little man! Come here! Come here! Come here! Oh, yeah! Come here! Tito, can you say hi? Can you say hi, YouTube? Can you say hi? Hi! Hey guys, um, so this is Tito. And I think that he's absolutely adorable. I swear the boy has more outfits than I do. Maybe I'll show you some of them sometime. Um, but yeah, I don't, he's not technically my dog, but since I moved in with my sister um, and he's her dog, we've been spending a lot of time together. We've been going on some walks. Do you like our walks, Tito? Do you like our walks? Hmm? Um, he and I actually have a lot in common. When we want to, we can be incredibly sweet, and then when we don't want to, we can get real nasty real quick. Um, what else do we have in common, bud? We're both kind of grumpy sometimes. Uh, we don't always play well with others. Well, that's not true. I'm pretty good at that, but he, he hates other dogs. Um, but let's see, yeah. So this is Tito. Tito, can you say hi? Tito, can you speak, buddy? <gasps> can you speak? He's like, I want to go kill whoever's in the hallway. Can you speak? Can you speak for the camera? He's like, hell no, get me down. Anyway, so for this week's topic, uh, we have to raid Google Images. Um, and I'm, I'm reading what the categories are off of my computer over here. So... The first picture, uh, and it's all about the future and like what our super ideal fantasy life would be like. So here is the house I would like to live in, in the future. Alright, so that was number one. Um, number two, my future husband, and I will definitely be inserting a pic of him right here. God, he's delicious. Mm. Let's see. Number three. <laughs> um, what outfit would you get married in? And I'm not going to put a picture in for that because I kind of want to get married naked, like on a beach connected to the earth. Very, you know, energy, like bare feet. My, my, the energy from the earth flowing through my feet up into my partner's hands, then down through his feet, back into the earth, whole cyclical thing. But don't worry, I'm not going to put a, a naked picture of myself in here. Number four, future car. And go. Number five, future neighbors. Uh, I don't really know who I'd want to live with. Honestly, if I, if it's really going to be my fantasy, 
Um, I wouldn't really have neighbors. I mean, I, I like the idea of living like out in a big house in the middle of nowhere. Um, or in a high-rise in, in Manhattan, you know, either way. Um, six, future plastic surgery. So the one th plastic surgery thing I would get is a tummy tuck, because I used to be super, super fat, and I stretched out my skin, and like, I swear, I can, I go to the gym, you know, four times a week maybe, and, or not necessarily go to the gym, but I work out like four times a week, and there is no, I mean, there's no six pack for me. It just is not gonna happen. Number seven, future pets. Other than Tito, I will insert a picture for you guys now. Aren't the little raddies so cute? Oh, I just love them so much. Number eight, future job. And here's the pick. And that's me. Uh, I My ideal future job would literally to just be able to travel the country and perform and make enough money to sustain myself. I think that that would be incredible. I mean, burlesque is really like my passion now. So that's what I would like to do in the future. Future number nine is future best friends. And I'll insert a pick. But honestly, I don't really think I want any different best friends. The best friends I have now are pretty fucking awesome. And number 10, the future me. What do I want to look like when I'm older? And uh, here's the picture. And I'd like to, I'd like to think that I could age as good as Brad Pitt, you know? I've, um... I've gotten you look like a young Brad Pitt a lot, which I think is like really weird because I don't think I look like Brad Pitt at all. But I mean, he's definitely gotten gotten pretty hot as he's gotten older. Not that he wasn't hot when he was young because he was hot then too. But yeah, so that was about it as far as this week's topic goes. Van, the makeup you're wearing in your video was fucking epic. That shit looks so good. Whatever you did to your lips, like, mm-hmm, yeah. Oh, there you go, bud. Yeah, that shit was crucial. Um, let's see. Thursday, Miss Deanna. I'm, I'm digging your side cut. Uh, I, I usually am not a huge fan of side cuts on girls, but, you know, I think, I think you're pulling it off pretty, pretty fucking well, so, hell yeah. I love that you've got the lady balls to rock that. Friday! Oh! Pinup is an amazing name for a pet. I absolutely love that name. It's so good. And ferrets are so cute. It makes me want a ferret so bad. Even though, in my experience, I've had some friends who've had them. And I just, I really can't get over the smell of a ferret. Um, but your glittery moustache, and I love the way you say moustache. Uh, is possibly the best thing I've ever seen. It absolutely made my day to see that glittery mustache. Uh, definitely, if you have not, take a chance to subscribe uh, so you can see all the wonderful uploads from all of us outlaws. I'll leave a link to my personal channel here so you can click on that if you want. Um, check it out. I don't have a day job anymore, so I'm probably going to be uploading a lot more videos, which means more tutorials, more makeup play fun. Um, wish me luck finding another job. <laughs> so, yeah. I think that's all. I'll see you guys next week.